Morning, welcome to another Round the Grounds episode with my good friend, 18 Dapper, Donny Rovers v Stockport County. How are you feeling, mate? Um, I think this is a free hit, to be honest. Yeah. I mean, we've got a really important February coming up, some big games in the teams in and around us. Stockport are top at the league, second top scorers, yeah. second tightest defence. Yeah. I think we've just got, to, <laughs> just got to go for it and whatever we get, be happy with. I'd, I'd be buzzing at a draw, I'd be ecstatic at getting a win. Yeah. I don't think we'll get either. <laughs> I find with Donny though, they always seem to perform better against yeah. the better sides. Obviously, I think last one hour we were drilling him. Um, we managed to beat MK Dons yeah. recently. Yeah, and we played well against teams in, in cups. We beat all. Yeah. Took Peter Broadway in FA Cup. Um, and then obviously Wigan in, in Bristol Street Motors Trophy. So I think there is there is quality in the squad. Yeah. It's just been really inconsistent this yeah. season. So yeah temper the expectations and then you'll not be disappointed <laughs> that, that is exactly right yeah. <laughs> so we're starting a little piece a little vlog today match day vlog a special location um, so we're going to cue the b-roll if you've not subscribed to this guy 18 dapper class donny content you stick with it stick with a two through thick and thin Got it, aren't you? So, yeah. <laughs> so check him out absolute great guy too so cue the b-roll and if you do please hit the like button drop a subscribe Give the big roll. See you soon, guys. Thought we'd uh, reminisce with you, <laughs> being a Donny fan. Come back to your roots. Yeah, you know well, it's, it's mad. I've not, I've not been here since we've left. Yeah. Um, I know people d did come down when, when it was closed down and, the, yeah, and yeah. they got on pitch and stuff. But it's the first time that I've really kind of walked around here since we, since we moved yeah. to Keep Out Now Eco Power. And yeah, it does. It, it brings a lot back. I mean, we've just been talking about kind of nights against Man City, yeah. Villa, and then Arsenal here. They're, they're big ones. But yeah, it's, it were home, weren't it? Yeah, I mean. That here is the old terracing for the yeah. uh, away end. I think it is, yeah. Yeah, I think because where we've positioned it, I think that's because back in the day, I always used to come. We you said the same. Yeah. There used to be a court back here, and they usually used to come and play on a in the morning, Saturday yeah. morning. I think I come down. Yeah, we're absolutely rank. Yeah. Con concrete, co concrete court. Yeah. Loads of little like <laughs> bricks, like broken bits of concrete. Like, do you know when tarmac starts yeah, pulling yeah. up? There were loads of that about. We were, old blue crash mats for keepers yeah. but they had no padding whatsoever yeah, literally your knees were cut up to hell when you but, well i absolutely loved it yeah, yeah i'd go back again yeah <laughs> i also have um i don't know if you had a, a little like a birthday parties yeah. here and stuff yeah, i'll overlay a picture now because I, I my dad sent me just like <laughs> memories like yeah. wow yeah, i'm i'm not a doddy fan and uh, how you must feel being here obviously it wasn't the best ground yeah, it, it were memories for yeah, you. Yeah, we were guys. saying it, it, it was a bit of a shed, it was a bit dilapidated, yeah. but, but it was ours. And yeah. like, like we said, we, we had some big teams come down. Yeah. I think because you've got such amazing stadiums and facilities now, teams that are used to that yeah, come yeah. down to stuff like this and, and, and it's a leveller. Yeah. If, if oh, it's an advantage to the team who's always used to it. Yeah. And yeah. I, think, I think you get that with a lot of. Sorry, it's helicopters. <laughs> Race is on today. We're not being chased by the police, don't worry. Yeah, let's get down. <laughs> um, but yeah, it, it's probably more of an advantage for the teams that, that play here, and I think we, I think we benefited from that in, in that yeah. in that Carabao Carling Cup run, yeah. Um, which yeah, that'll stick long in memory for, for a lot of fans who were here. Yeah. And where did you used to sit? Um, I didn't say it. We stood. Stood. That's it. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> no. Because we obviously the, the the street names is Rovers Way, Popular Moves. Yeah. Pop, yeah. Popular stands were over the, over at the far side. That's yeah. where like all the singing section was. And yeah. um, that's where all atmosphere was generated. Yeah. Um, then there was the town end, which was yeah. closed for a long a long period of time. But then they they, re they renovated that. So renovated. Yeah. They kind of re <laughs> reconcreted yeah. a bit. Um, put some port cabins on as as yeah. hospitality boxes. But we we just stood in, in main stand, yeah. Um, so you had the seated area which were under cover. We stood kind of in line with eighteen yard line yeah, yeah. Um, towards towards town end. Yeah. So me, my brother, dad, 
people who are still going now. Yeah. Uh, my granddad, who, who was, who was pa- passed away, he, he managed to see both stadiums um, yeah. and then passed away shortly after moving to the new one. Yeah, yeah. And then obviously Mac's nephew never saw this. He never had the delights of yeah, yeah. going to the toilet, which was just a wall. Yeah. <laughs> no yeah. covering or anything. Yeah. Um, yeah. I miss it. It's nice that someone's still here. Yeah. Uh, obviously, they've they've done the streets. I think there's plaques that we're going to check yeah. out. I'm, su- um, I'm surprised there's nothing like marking centre yeah. circle. We'll talk about this on. There, there might be. We might have just missed it. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, some sometimes like. Well, Main road. I think they've got the centre circle. Yeah. There's, stuff there's like one that. that where there's like a plaque in middle of a car park. Is yeah. It, is um, that Hull? Hull. Hull's got one. I think they've got the street names. Um. You trigger in my memory because I've been to one recently and they've still got the plaque. Yeah, it's in, it's in the middle of a retail estate, isn't it? Yeah, no, the um, it's Scunthorpe. It's Scunny. It's Scunny. It's yeah, because it's a supermarket now. Yeah, and the plaque's on the wall. Yeah, but yeah, it, it might be around somewhere. Yeah, I don't know, but yeah, it's. Uh, and obviously, it's nice you've got your memories with a burnt down. That triggered when I was yeah. looking to research. <laughs> obviously, the old chairman. They tried to burn it down because they wanted to sell the land because this was prime. Yeah, it's prime real estate. I think this, if I remember rightly, the actual um, location was more lucrative or more financial. Yeah. More fi- financially, there was more financial gain than some areas in London, London yeah. at the time. Because um, Asda it, wanted to get their hands on it for a while. Yeah, there, there were a few few people that wanted to get their hands on it, and obviously you can see there's plenty of houses yeah. on here. If these are all selling for one to two hundred k a piece, yeah, yeah, you've got a lot of. A lot of investment, yeah. a lot of money. And then back in the day, we were saying it was supposed to be a little air, aerodrome. And, uh, yeah, I'm not sure if that was here or if it was like around Asda and a bit further yeah. back, but it did used to be an airport, around and that's why we've got the um, the air museum yeah. uh, that's yeah, there yeah. as well. So, yeah, yeah it was a wonderful pitch. Yeah, one yeah. of the biggest in, I think it was one of the biggest in Europe at the time. Yeah. It was almost as wide as what it yeah. was long. Did you ever play on it? No. Yeah. No. You ever thought, go on it just being a kid or out? Yeah, we had a few pitch invasions and stuff. <laughs> so, but yeah, I mean, we we played on on Eco Power and yeah. um, and that pitch seemed big. So I dread to think what it was like running around on that, especially yeah. with, like I say, it was about as wide as what it was one. Yeah, and yeah. That leveled a, a lot of games because yeah. teams are used to narrowing pitch and yeah. we just spread it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we thought we'd come down and uh, check out the uh, Donny Rovers Old Ground Bellevue. Um, it's just great to see some sort of memory of it. Um, but, yeah, we're going to head over to Eco Power today for today's match day vlog. So we'll see you soon, guys. Hey, two Stockport County fans, what's your names? I'm Jeff. Caleb. How are you feeling coming into this fixture?
condolences to the family and friends of Gary Chambers, Gary who was a lifelong Rovers uh, So that's another match day vlog done. Stockport County, a big win away from home at the Eco Power. Five goals to one against a very, very poor Doncaster Rovers side. Uh, credit to Stockport. When the chances presented the sends, they were ruthless. They punished Donny. Um, and you can tell that's why they're at the top of the league. Scoring goals, they've got that quality. Um, but on Donny, I think I'd be really worried if I were a Donny Rovers fan. Um, lack of effort. Um, I think when when the teams like Stockport come to town, you've you've just got to put that effort in, and put your foot in, and just make it a little bit ugly. Um, we just just passed passed the game by for me. Just no no lead is in there to to get the boys up and just get them by the scruff of the neck. Uh, and if I were a Donny fan, I'd, I'd be really really worried, um, getting sucked sucked into it. Um, into that relegation dog, dog fight um, yeah it must be frustrating for you all obviously coming to support your team down at the Eco Power um, I don't know what he's going to do with McCann whether he brings in that experience because for me I think you're lacking it I think there's too many youth uh, in there no no real leaders uh, so whoever he addresses that just get some loans in just to shore it up and just get that experience in there to see him over the line, I don't know. Um, Donny fans get in the comments, tell me what you, you're feeling. Be interested to get your thoughts, because um, watching that, I'd be really worried. But Stockport, they're looking good. The travelling fans uh, turning out in numbers to, to support the team. 
uh, and another win um, and still top of the league. Is it your season? Get in the comments because uh, watching that, I think uh, it'll be hard push to, to knock you off top spot. Um, like I say, you're really ruthless uh, against a, a poor Donny side. But enjoyed another vlog um, here at the Eco Power. If you enjoyed this vlog, please, please smash the like button. Drop a subscribe if you're new round here. Really helps me and it'd be great to have as many subscribers as I can. Um, just, just love him bringing the football content. Thank you everyone for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Thanks everyone.